I see you bear the markings of old Siwa. Is that a real Magi badge? How much would you sell it for? Siwa is my homeland, and it is not for sale. Everything is for sale here. You should visit Valley Market to the east. They have Siwa and treasures, not the normal fake stuff. These are real. I would be interested to meet anyone selling genuine Siwa and treasures. Are you sure you do not want to sell that badge? No matter. Look for the stall under the bird's nest. You will thank me. Did you hear about that new stall with the treasures from the temple in Siwa? From a temple? Are you crazy? You don't know. Uh. Welcome. We have many unique treasures for sale. Would you learn? This is your stall? Yes, mine. Many unique treasures from faraway Siwa. Not fake. Not fake. Have you got anything real? I'm sure these are not your best pieces. What do you mean? These are real. Hmm. More expensive ones at my camp. I can take you. Not far from here. You follow. That Magi badge. Not very good, you know. We have better ones. Would you like? I like this one. <laughs> these are the treasures of yours. Are they fake as well? I told you. Not fake. Oh, how did you know? My treasures aren't really real, but not fake. My mother ah. has some real ones anyway. Hey, I have a secret. I was once a Medja in Siwa. I've seen the real treasures. Oh, not fair. I made them all myself, you know. No one else can tell. Ooh. Do not worry. They are very good fakes. I will not tell anyone. I said, not fake. Were you really Magi? Maybe you are fake. Ah, <laughs> hey. You're a very cheeky child. Now let's see what your mother has. We go along the canal. You lead. I will fake it. Does not even make sense. Do not be afraid. <laughs> Do not be afraid. Lucky for you, I am real. Stay here.
got a nice sword. Would you like? Who in Hades are you? I told them I do not have any money, but I have many unique treasures from Siwa. Mother, he is not a bandit. He is my friend. Thanks for saving us. I guess you are real. Sorry I said you were fake. He saved us? We have to give him something. We always repay kindness, remember? I've got something. Here. This is a genuine imitation Siwan Kopish. It is very rare. They don't make them anymore. Please. Take it with our gratitude. Mother, he already knows. Thank you. I'm honored. Yes, I can tell. This one's really real. There are almost none like it. May you multiply happy years.
my need is great. grow fatter and richer in Egypt, while we go hungry. The poor are taxed more than the rich. Why is this happening? This is our home. Egypt belongs to us. Prosperity for all, they say. Well, where is it? Where are the benefits? The peace of mind? It is all with the Greeks. It is not Greek. The new laws are made by Greeks, no Greeks. Our fire, our is now a place where there are Greek-only stalls. These naked Iadis will not even serve Egyptians. I must be careful now. Ah, 
You need supplies, traveler? You need supplies, traveler? Burning corpse? But, hey, why are you burning the dead? Don't you fear the gods? Their souls will be forever cursed. I'm sorry to do it, but I have no choice in this. The gods themselves have afflicted us with a pestilence. The dead must be burned to save the living. What pestilence? Is there a plague? Truly, I don't know. Elders have begun falling sick. Children have died clutching their bellies in agony as their parents watch on, lifeless in their beds. This would be cruel, even for the angriest of gods. No one cares about us. Any help would be appreciated. In the Fayum, the poor aren't worth spit. Burning corpses? This is blasphemy. Who did this? My children, your hunger is known. Turn to Sobek for your nourishment. There are no signs of a plague on the body. Now lose their land. They used to eat at the arms kitchen in the market, but soldiers began harassing them. Greek merchants said they were bad filthy. for business. What have the villagers been eating? They must have the food stored somewhere. We should have a look around. We should move this way. Uh. This food is rancid. It smells like shit. It's completely unfit for eating. This gruel is not fit for rats, let alone people. The strong spices are not for taste. They are disguising the rot. I need to talk with whoever made it. Sobek has provided a way. Though the food is humble, it gives life. Eat with thanksgiving. And trust in he who is pointed of teeth. Tell me about the food you eat. Where does it come from? A merchant makes it for the poor here. It's not much, but at least it's something. We're thankful. You're welcome to try some. By the gods, no. I do not know how you stomach it. I need to talk to the merchant. Where can I find him? His house is to the south of the town market. I can take you. Let's visit this merchant of yours. I will follow you. May Sobek reward you for helping. I've passed many prosperous farms. 
people here seem to be doing well. Why are there so many poor? Ah, yes. Those are Greek farms. The Greeks pay lower taxes, so they prosper. Meanwhile, the Egyptian farmers are slowly forced from their lands. What happens to the land when the farmers leave? Once the owners die, by law the land is freed. If it's good land, the Greeks take it. If not, the desert takes it. Either way, Egyptians are left to starve. Many end up in the slums. This is the home of the merchant who provides the food. Even the cats here look better fed than the poor. The owner is obviously of substance. Not all Egyptians seem to be equal. Some are just more equal than others. This is awful! No wonder people are falling sick. Who would do this? It is time we met this poisonous merchant. Give him a taste of his own cooking. How may I help you? This is my home. Are you lost? You can explain to me why you have been poisoning the poor. My guess is so you can take their land. It is easier if they are dead. You're referring to the trouble in the slums? Whatever you've heard, I assure you, you misunderstand. I do what I can to help. I have seen your kitchen, merchant. I know what you are doing. And I will see that you are brought to justice. Oh, I see. Well, that changes things. Now, you're trespassing. And I have the right to protect myself. Men! If you were reasonable, I wouldn't have to do this. We could have worked this out. I'm not dying over this. Hold him up. Beggars! Why do you care so much about them? No one will miss them. We can talk about this. I'm wealthy. I can pay you. This merchant of death was murdering the poor for their land. His love of money was the real sickness. Fayum won't miss him. The dead can rest. There will be no more burning.
This evil boy has profaned the gods. His punishment will be an example and an atonement. His hand for thievery, his son. Punishment will be an example and an atonement. His priest, what has the boy done to deserve this? This has nothing to do with you. Back away. The boy will get what he deserves. I serve so bad. I serve so bad. I am a slave. Boy, what are you accused of? I was charged with ferrying two gold sobeks to Crocodilopolis. Just out of port, my ship sank by the lighthouse. I almost drowned. The statues were lost. I didn't steal them. Silence! And you, step back, Sahedi. Wait. Do not threaten me, Neb. I am a Magi. If the boy speaks the truth, I will find your gold sorbex. If he lies, he is yours to deal with. I should check the big Octarim ship. of limits.
golden statue of Sobek. It is beautiful. The boy tells the truth. Call me paranoid, but something's close. Recent shipwreck. This could be it. A golden statue of Sobek. Beautifully made. Just as the boy said it would be. I should return these gold Sobeks to that odious priest.
Stealing from a god is the gravest of... Priest, I have your precious golden sorbex. Your novice spoke the truth. This useless boy has been constant trouble. Many more punishments await him for his carelessness. Your priest clothing is just a mask for cowardice! God, the gods I hate masks. This has nothing to do with you, Saheti. Crawl back into your desert hole! I am Medjai, you dishonorable dog! This place is heavily guarded. Your authority is removed with your mask, priest. May you walk in the land of the Duat. What do I do now? The temple will not accept me. Sobek has left the fate of this gold with you. You can return to the temple or to your family. The choice is yours. May Sobek be with you. Whatever you do, do it honorably. Egypt needs priests who do not wear masks. <laughs>
مخمك مشى جم ولا معه خروا من جيت Zeni, forgive me. I overheard you just now. You said something about a man beast. The man beast has been taking people from here for months. People have gone missing. Have you told the Philakitai? The Philakitai are useless. Just last week, three fishermen disappeared. Bits of them floated in a few days later. They did nothing. Anyway, we know who it is. That raving old maniac over there. We're watching him. Things are often not what they appear. I should talk to this man-beast. He might be possessed by Sobek himself. He's too crazy to be the man-beast. He never does anything but pray. He is eating the victims of Sobek. No one goes missing on his land. They just show up in the water near his house. We should leave him alone. His poor child. Anything taken by the current ends up here. <clears throat> Flesh. It is rotting and waterlogged, and hard to identify. It has come here from upstream. This place is a damn slaughter yard. But I cannot tell if the flesh is human. In all my years as a Magi, I have never seen anything like this. It is floating here from somewhere farther upstream. My friend, could I speak with you? Do you know anything about the missing people? I am not your friend. Go away from here! So Peck eats with his mouth. He with the pointed teeth. So Peck eats while he mates. He rents whom he will. I will not get anything useful out of him.
Hi. What is your name? This is my toy, Sobek. See? He carries his babies in his mouth. Father made it for me. That is a... a nice toy. Can you tell my friends to come back and play? Sobek didn't really eat the people in the river. It's just a game. Body parts. Where are they all coming from? More oh, blood in the water. Seems to be coming from that cave. By the moon, what is going on? for some kind of deal. Good wine and refreshments. Whoever sat here was well pampered. <clears throat> Cushions and luxury. These look like seats for some kind of theater. Thank the gods! Hurry! We have to leave before he comes back! Who? What is happening here? The embalmer. He's throwing people to crocodiles. His guests watch as they're ripped apart. Be calm. You are safe. Where is he now? Safe? No one is safe here. He kidnapped me at the market where I was selling fish. I'm getting out of here. I never imagined anyone could do something like this. 
I will find a way to the market. This embalmer has given his last show. Such extravagance. This embalmer is making a lot of money. in the slum. strikes. The poison bites. I watch light fall away. A face once flushed by violent love is turned to ash and gray. But greater than death's bitters. Hello, Tua. I see you have taken up street performing. Bayek! <laughs> Not really. I just find the poetry reading comforting. It ha but greater than death's bitter scheme, the claws and stinging tails. A feather white and gold as light to weigh on Ma'at's scales. The path is steep. I climb, I climb with heavy feet. And heavy eyes, I weep, I weep with poisoned tears. To reach the peak, I watch, I watch the broken neck.
Best not to draw attention here. Petruchos is angry. The image of Sobek shows the god's will. What will we do? I shall heal Sobek. Continue to worship. Gladiatorial Excuse me. What can you tell me about? Hey, Neb. What can you tell me about the men who fight here? Men? These are not men, they're gods. You've never seen such savage warriors. They could break... Ah. Do any of them have red hair? Gods among gods. Have you never heard of the brothers from Gaul? Can't you? Sir, we need more... Are you the owner here? Yes, I am the owner. Felix Martialis. Who are you? Another rough knuckle no-name seeking fame? I only want entry to the arena. I heard you have got a fighter worth watching. Ah, you mean the Gallic brothers. You heard right. But let me save you some time, camel boy. You cannot afford it. Now piss off before you scare away someone who can. Sir... This man wears a Magi badge. Ahmed what? <laughs> I do not even care. Can you fight? You look the part, like a vicious, mangy dog. <laughs> nah, nah. I have already got an Egyptian. A huntress from Siwa, who's worth three of you. 
She frequents the obelisk in the East End if you want an impromptu beating. It is the only way inside this arena. Fight in the streets, and the gladiator can bring you in. So, the Gallic brothers are involved in Shadia's murder. But why are they doing the crocodile's bidding? I need to get inside and learn more. The arena owner mentioned a C1 gladiator to the east at an obelisk. I wonder if I know her. Siwa is a small place. I should go and see. See one. Wait. That looks like. place to, to prosper. Hmm? <laughs> but I never expected to find you here, Ketsa. <laughs> what can I say? I heard the call of the arena. <laughs> can you believe it? I am a gladiator now. Huh? <laughs> but come, come. Let us talk. And drink. <laughs> I'm telling you, Bayek, I am so close to my dream. If only I was given the chance, I know I could become champion. I mean wealth, luxury, fame. What more could a woman want? Huh? That's why I came to Fayum. To make a new life for myself and bury the past. But I was turned away from the arena doors. <laughs> so you have finally given up trying to put the world to rights. Good. Such things are impossible. Felix is slow to trust outsiders. But do not worry. With my backing, we'll soon be fighting side by side. First, we drink. And in the morning, we can go to the arena for the proper introductions. Eh, it's good to have you here, old friend. I make the leap and fall, and fall and land in peace. Clear up! Hurry!
I want this man to be my partner. As it happens, the Iberian was torn apart by lions yesterday. I may have an opening. And if Kemsa vouches for you? You will need a title if you're going to team up, though. How about the Siwan Warriors? I think the Guardians of Siwa would be more fitting. Is that memorable enough for you? I have heard worse. Come inside. This is where combatants wait their turn on the sand. What you smell is sweat, blood, and not a little offal. If you are predisposed to shit in your armor, this is where to do it. There is no pharaoh or god in the arena to protect you, Magi. <laughs> this is where you will probably die. Try to do it with drama. It pleases the crowd. On the off chance you live, you will be rewarded with glory and fame. And another chance to die. Such is the short but luminous life of a gladiator. All right, who do we have? Ah, there is Callistos. Callistos, a former soldier of Ptolemy who claims to know how to handle his sword. Horus, he was my best fighter once, but age ruins us all. He's not much more than a bedpan now. He trains the novices. Is that armor from Ptolemy's army? Most of the fighters cannot afford their own armor. In any case, it is soon ruined. The army does not miss a few suits here and there, and it adds to the authenticity. Speaking of authenticity, in the arena, you use the weapons I give you. There are no exceptions. You already know Kensa, whose glowing but suspect recommendation brought you here. Crocodilopolis welcomes another champion! Or another bag of blood and shit. I want to see if he can fight. And who better to test him than the one who recommended him? <laughs> what do you say? Ready to draw a sword, old Magi? <laughs> Let's see if you have improved. I'm not going to deal with this one! <laughs> Man. <laughs> How is that for all? Nick, I thought I had you. <laughs> you need more style and flash, but you have got a pleasing, vicious trick for a sandbox. Okay, Kinsa, you've got a new partner. We open the door soon. Be ready. Are the scraps that Felix wants to throw our way? <laughs> they make a poor meal, my brother. <laughs> I'm going to slice off your balls and feed them to you. Our main obstacle to glory, the Gallic brothers. I know who they are. Are you well, my friend? You seem distracted. I'm fine.
We are ready. <laughs> are you? <laughs> Everyone thinks they are ready till they get a fist in the face. I am starting you against a few novices. If you survive, we will talk about more. Two warriors against the odds. The crowds love unfair fights. Do not disappoint them. Or me. I admire you, Rebu. Are they screaming for our blood or for theirs? Any blood will do. No such thing as innocent. Do not stake your blade, brother. They certainly will not. Every man here knows the rules. You have taken to this new life easily. Can you see the look on their faces? Oh, they adore me by it. The men, the women. I have everything I could want. Oh. These two sand bandits are tougher than you look. of a wealthy patron. And what then? Then a whole new world of opportunity, my friend. The best gladiators are sent on special missions. And more coins than you can imagine. <laughs> then let us make sure they notice us. you two toast dabbers was one of my best ideas. The crowd loves you. I told you we were destined for greatness, Felix. <laughs> greatness? Oh, oh, oh. Easy, easy, damsel dust mite. You have a... If what Kensa says is true, any of the gladiators could be working for the crocodile. We are on our way, old friend. After all this time, I might finally get my shot at the Gallic brothers. And it's thanks to you. Hey, I would like nothing more. What about these other contracts you mentioned earlier? Oh, the righteous Bayek is willing to dirty his hands. Times have changed, Seni. I suppose it is hard to be a Magi all the time. You will have to ask Felix about those. Quietly. The best way to reach the Crocodile is to beat the Gallic brothers. Felix. I've heard some gladiators are chosen for... extra work. You heard wrong. And if there was an arrangement, you would have much more to do to earn your way in. <laughs> your job, you upstart dog noble, is to fight. That is it. You earn... <laughs> Lions. <laughs> Only when Felix can get them. They are much more expensive than men volunteering for it. There seems little honor in killing animals. Kill or be eaten by it. This it's cage. We will be fine. As long as we don't free it. 
Lions are caged. <laughs> there are no rules in the arena, Sammy. Where's Kensa? Her talents were required elsewhere today. Is Kensa okay? Holy Anubis. I have to win this. Is that Callistos? What happened? I warned him. He took a bad job. Just another blunt instrument for them to break against their enemies. Do you know who hired him? No. Felix won't.
all the Anubis. I have to win this. I'm sorry I left you to fight alone, but I hear you did me proud. Felix sent you out on a job. Who was it for? I'll tell you everything in good time, brother. Just know that our future has never looked brighter. So, your turn to fight the brothers. I, I won't say. 
Good luck. You won't get any. But listen to me. They are too strong together. That's how they beat me. Separate. Separate them. Fight one, one at a time. And maybe you live. Thank you, Horus. There are worse things than dying. Be careful. You have done well for a country, Conrad. Your time has come. The crowd is bored with Viridovics and Diovicos destroying opponents with ease. I am counting on you to make this entertaining. One more thing. Do not kill anyone. I want my top four fighters alive for rematches. I have given the Gauls the same order. All right! We will not kill them. But no promises about pain and humiliation. <laughs> this is it, Bayek. Our big moment. They will build monuments and scroll our names across temples after this. We will be a born, rich, and champions! Here are the contenders to the crown! The guardians of Siwa! Undefeated! Unmatched! It's the Gaelic Brothers!
The Gallic Brothers are defeated! You kill the child called Shadia! That is the least to deserve! The lighthouse! Ah. We didn't kill her at once! We have done many terrible things, Siwan! But the murder of the child is not one of them! All hail the new champions! We were the there! Guardians the guardians of Siwan! Capture the girl! And take her to Berenike! To, to the crocodile! It was she who drowned the child, took a book from her, ordered a stone tied to her ankles, and pushed her in the water. There was nothing we could do. This is the real reason you came to me, isn't it? To uncover this patron, this crocodile. Bayek, why didn't you confide in me? Huh? I would have helped you. You're a mercenary, just now, like them. I couldn't take the chance. What fate awaits the fallen? No. Will it be life? Bayek. Or death? You know me better than... Death. Bayek, you have to know! So it was Berenike. She is the crocodile. She is the one who kills Sharia. She is the one who has brought ruin to so many. She calls herself the sponsor of Fayum's prosperity and culture. And her influence is felt throughout the region. Her wealth comes from her estate north of the city, Kerkesucha Granary, the largest in all of Egypt. She has arranged a symposium with others of influence in Fayum. Every night, she retires to her villa, where she courts their favor with bribes and silvered words. Then that is where I will find her. Thank you for everything, my friend. What will you do now? I will retire to our family villa. I need a drink. Henut and I must mourn in peace. Farewell, Bayek. Once you have done what you must, you would be...
Is there no justice left in this world? The gods have abandoned us. Was this your house? Who are you? Gods, what does it matter? I refuse to sell to that shriveled, wretched Lady Berenike. A wiser man would not have defied her. Soldiers arrived last night with oil. You see the result. Where did the soldiers come from? From the granary to the north. They have enough oil there. Are you mad? Nobody opposes the Lady Berenike. She will destroy you, your family, and everything you hold dear. She could not afford the wedding. Now they are both begging for food in the slums. The damned slums. We cannot even trust the This day. Oh, mine now.
Are you enjoying your new station, my champion? Yes, my lady. recipient of the best in Greek culture. And it's thanks to our honorable lady. We are all humble beneficiaries of her elegance, education, and impeccable taste. Culture for all. As long as you are loyal. As long as you never fear. Yes. Kensa, is this the luxury you sought? to be a slave to an enemy of Egypt. Shadia! Murdered by one of you. Shadia. Who? Shadia! She was the child you drowned! Like all of your kind, you fail to see what greatness lies in store for Egypt. Is that what you tell yourself? You do not remember those you killed. She was the child of Henut and Hotefres. Henut was a stubborn rock. That ledger would have meant the end to all our hopes. You destroyed families. <laughs> I did what had to be done. I will destroy everything you stand for, Berenike! And I will destroy all others like you! But for now, all that matters is that you killed Shadia! And the last word you will remember is her name! Shadia! Oh shit! Fuck! <laughs> 
Andy! Oh. Shit! They're here too! Okay, Layla, listen. I know you. And I know you'll find a way out of this. <sighs> Picked up that blade I found. Good. Tadakar, alayk al tachalos min al hadaf. Toma astaidet al animus. Well, they're definitely planning to kill me. You've been living in the mind of a trained assassin for the past however many hours. Remember? So get ready to rock, killer queen. I'm ready, American woman. They're using bows, not guns. Why? Guess they don't consider you much of a threat. Huh. They're almost on me. Going dark. How's it going? Bad. I have to do this. It's them or me. Listening to this, you work for Abstergo and I'm dead. Do me a favor and make sure Sophia Ricken hears it. My dream was to work on the Animus project. I waited 12 years. Waiting got me nowhere. So I built an Animus that lets me access anyone's memories, even ancestors not my own. I even witnessed the origins of the assassins. Artifacts, tombs that were supposed to be stuff of legends, I found them. By killing me, you've lost all this knowledge. I understand why you thought I had to die. But did you have to kill my best friend? What did she? Oh, Habibti. I should have listened to you.
Fres and Henuta. I should visit them. I've killed all these naked Yadet. Apollodorus must be told. To Heraklion. Here are vigilant. Oh. <laughs> is a happy recipient of the best in Greek culture. And it's thanks to our honorable lady. We are all humble beneficiaries of her elegance, education, and impeccable taste. Culture for all. Due to the unceasing efforts of our honorable lady, the biome is prospering again. There is no... Statues of Aphrodite you see around the villa grounds hide a wonderful secret. These images of the goddess of beauty were all modeled after our honorable lady of the villa. Bios is the happy recipient of the best in Greek culture. And it's thanks to our honorable lady, we are all humble beneficiaries of her elegance, education, and impeccable taste. Culture for all. Who is there to compare to our lady of the villa? Who has... Fayun is the happy recipient of the best in Greek culture. And it's thanks to our honorable lady.
Wait a second. A waste of my skin. My duty call. Mine now! 
could swear something is out here. I hear you, Philip. Stay with me. We must not fail. Cover my back.
not expose yourself, Gideon! Distract the enemy! I will push on! What? You have a nice yeah. reception ready. Not ah! happy.
daughter about asset? Her daughter was promised in marriage, but she could not afford the wedding. Now they are both begging for it. And what about Raho? His family lost their farm to weak friends of the nomad. Now they are forced to work like slaves on the land they want own. Nick! We cannot... Neo Jigam?
Give me time to get loose! 